Welcome back to the Dev Skills Car Channel. And as you can see, I've got a bit of an issue. I've got a puncture in my tyre, but that doesn't mean we have to hot foot it down to the garage and get it fixed. This is actually something we can do ourselves with a little toolkit that I've got. So, we'll take the wheel off. Unfortunately, I'm not next to my little compressor. That's not to hand at the moment, so I'm gonna to to take the wheel off. Now, if I did have access to it, I could actually leave the wheel and tire on the car and wouldn't have to do this, but. So, I'm gonna get it up in the air, take the wheel off. Now, if you've never done this sort of thing before, if you don't even know how to take a wheel off, that's no problem. Um, I'll link above a video that I made. But if you're an absolute newbie to this sort of thing, uh, there's a step-by-step -step guide there teaching you how to take a, a wheel off a car. There's the offending article. If it was something in the sidewall, then we'd have to seek professional guidance, I'm afraid, because the tire might be uh, unsalvageable, but it's right in the middle, it's dead easy. We know where the puncture is, there it is. That's probably one of my screws, to be honest. So we've got this kit off Amazon. Brilliant kit, about 12 quid, it's got all sorts of bits and pieces in there. This is like a little needle, a little riving tool. So we're gonna make our hole big enough that we can get our fix in. So rive it about. Open that hole up a bit. Now the tire is properly knackered now, so we're gonna to have to make sure we fix it. Now we're gonna get our little needle. And you see there's all sorts of things in there. We're gonna use these black rubber things that look like licorice. These are our plugs, essentially. So we're gonna pull one of those off. Stick it on the needle tool. And I'm gonna push that in. And we're gonna push it past where you think it needs to go. So we're gonna go in, and then we're gonna pull the needle tool out. And what you didn't see on the end of that needle tool is a very small cut. And so when you pull it out, it actually cuts that black licorice thing in half and it pulls itself out. And now we can cut those little tails off. Fill our tyre back up with air to the required pressure. Put the valve cap back on. Now we can stick it back on the van. So that was a dead simple fix. It's probably saved me 30 quid, probably. Not having to go to the garage and get it repaired. Now, if you're into this sort of thing, or you're new to this sort of thing, and you feel like it's something you want to do, um, there's loads of videos on the channel. Basic car maintenance videos, there's oil changes, that sort of thing, brake pad changes. These are all things you can do at home. So take a look at those. I'll link one at the end. And happy motoring. I'll see you again real soon. Cheers.